Welcome, one more day, good morning. Today is kinda, this day is difficult. It's gonna rain in any moment. Not any moment, but maybe the next hour, so I have to work fast. I have this one, it's a 2020 Lincoln. So we're gonna replace the windshield. Um, Cause got a hit right there on the bottom of the driver's side. So we're gonna use dealer Adam. That's gonna help better with the calibration in this, in this case. But that's the only I found on the Migram website with the dealer Adam glass. Okay, so let's gonna pull this one. As you see, it's the same easy on this part of the wipers. So this one remind me the the escape about the clips on the bottom, so nothing difficult. So I think it's more simple this time on this 2020. So let's gonna take those clips. It's kind of Open a little bit, let me hook from here because they're kind of hard this time. They feel really tight. Let me see if I can just grab it from here. So we're gonna take another couple of here. The glass is ready with primer and everything, okay? So let me open a little bit this guy. There you go. And take these clips. Got a man bunch of these guys. There you go. One more just watch out the line. Just open a little bit. This time with their new they're very tight to just watch out this line okay. I try to work fast because it's gonna rain. There you go. And that's it. So after that Remember, it's gonna snap on the on the bottom with the retainer molding. So right here, so I'm gonna open this a little bit, not much. Just put it down, open this little piece, and the rest is more easy. There you go, down a little bit. Even the shot was at the center point. There you go. Just a little retainer here, don't break it, just put it down. Because last time I did another one and it was broken, and this is the only part that's going to catch this part of the fender. You break it, it's going to give you issues with the losing part right there. Let me open this guy. There you go. There you go. You see, got to be one piece and take it off. So, this part we're good. Okay, guys, really now easy. we're going to just pull the. Um, the cover, I have to cut the video a little bit. My customer just came and asked me about how long it's gonna take. So this one, remember, has a clip here and another clip here, but this one is a retainer for the cow. I mean, the, the cover, because they don't want it to be exposed or hitting the customer, I mean, the customers, the driver's size passengers. Right here, we got another one behind this guy. Right here, let me show you. On this part, right there. But this one, let me see if I can show you with the, so inside there we have a belt right here. You see this little guy? So this guy right here is gonna hold it just to prevent this part of this 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 uh this uh let me put it on my shoulder right here. This guy hit the customers when they have an accident. Okay, let me just see A hey, right there. So let me see if I can open it from here. Because this guy is always this hard. Let me see if I can get Hey, got it right here. So as you see, in an accident, this is the same like a brake system. You see, it's going to go stay like that. That's why they make this little bill. Now, this one is expensive, so you got to take them off from here. But don't take this one off, just do from here. The same like when you do the back glasses pillar. You see right there? Just make a twist, twist a little bit, and twist in again, and it's gonna be out, okay? But you can just leave this uh, cover and just hand in right here if you want, but I don't like it stuff in front of me, okay? And that's all. After that, you're gonna use the multi tool tool. Sorry, I'm little right now because I have a uh, rain coming down so I don't want to be catch there's no place here to cover so we made over here I'm gonna take this bracket or the plug I mean watch out for this button over here there you go all right now this
this guy remember have a clips but I don't have too much room here so I can try use my hook or maybe disconnect it but I don't like I don't want to disconnect anything today on this car because sometimes any sensors can give it cold so I don't want to do anything because I don't have calibration today. let me open this guy so push it like this and that's all be careful with the sensor I'm gonna go behind the bracket right here Blammy, I don't see it that much all right now let's take the camera out you know the same like all cameras with the clips even a little pressure right here can take them off okay so we got the camera off the mirror is not a big deal that was not giving me a signal just the other sensors all right let's see now i have there you go and it's coming up and remember let's go behind this guy about this one and there you go okay so all the sensors right there so let's gonna stop here that's gonna set the orange band i keep the video here a little bit to make it shorter and i'll be right back just to make the cut the set and we finish okay because we're faster we go fast because it's raining coming and probably next hour so let's gonna finish now okay see you next shot guys remember this one is no molding on the sides of the top but the clips on the corners they are kind of tough okay they sound like the force do all the time and we just work slow have the line to get the angle with your hand if you want i'm gonna catch the clip now there's the clip there you go Watch out for all these brackets. We don't want to catch it and break the line. Just play guitar. There and let's do the other bottom. That's when you get the onion or the clothes for the using. And we finish. Just closing the angle. Have to stop and all down okay guys so let's go the next step now here remember you can go the first wheel right there just make sure you got the right size it's not touching it's perfect like there Remember these blades they are really nice. I'm gonna use just probably more thin than usually we use with the piece from now. You see how thin was it? So remember the glass on this uh, Carlite or Lincoln I mean they show they're gonna show us the D 
the dots we're gonna follow for the urethane okay and this one as you see is not completely touching the molding it's a little, little bit more higher and here we're gonna make a curve okay so let's, uh, it's gonna make Come on. we're gonna follow this dot Remember, we're not going to put too much urethane on these cars. Not too high, not too low. Just in the middle point. Remember, we're gonna just finish the job, put it all parts together, and that's all we have to do. I'm gonna make a little adjust just to make sure the glass is, you know, even with the pins, you gotta make sure you got the right spot on the size or the measure ones, you know, and that's all. And inside, as you see, it's completely clean, nothing is show up. The urethane is behind the line right there, so you don't have nothing more on this way, other sides, okay? So the pins on place. So remember we're gonna finish the job the same way we did, yeah, pull all the parts place. together. Okay guys, thank you so much. This was Luis for BD Colorado Glass Replacement. Always on the top of the job. Thank you so much and see you next shot.